Welcome guys, this is Edwin and today we have a beauty for you guys, okay? This is one of those classic designs that people love and hey, I love it as well. But not only that, it's one of those rare pieces. It's a fully blacked out handmade custom by Ernest Emerson and the model name is the CQC Five, the smaller brother, right, of the CQC6. And today I'm carrying a CQC6, so we'll do a comparison. But look at this beauty from 2016. Checker handles, all handmade, guys. All handmade by Ernest Emerson. Blacked out bolsters, blacked out blade. Just a beauty. Check that classic. Tanto, right? That is characterized by the CQC6 and CQC5. Okay, like you can see in terms of logos, you have that Emerson Speckward knife. This guy does have a wave. And again, just a little close up so you can enjoy this beauty. Brand new. Check it out. Check it out. Just a beauty. And this is the other side, chisel ground, right? A zero grind, I will say. Look at that, super sharp, perfect, perfect lockup. Blacked out liners, again, the whole thing is the blacked out CQC5 from the auction in 2016, if I remember correctly. And the CQC5 is like a 2.75 inch, blade and seven inches overall so it's a small blade guys okay let me show you how it compares against the classic full size cqc7 in this case we're looking at the tactical element right with the right hand chisel grind but just to give you an idea you know the cqc7 is a 3.3 inch blade eight inches overall and this is how it compares against the cqc5 and let me tell you, I do know a lot of brothers and sisters in the community that their main carry is a CQC5, you know? It does a great job, and again, enough blade to get the job done, and for EDC tax, it's just perfect out there, okay? But you can see really thinner on that dimension in comparison with the CQC7. Feels great in the hand. Let me show you that. Feels great. I love the wave in the little CQC5. Feels great. Give you that purchase, right? In this style of grip. Man, those checker handles feel amazing. Okay? Backspacer, just a freaking beauty. Let me show you how it compares against the CQC6 that I've been carrying. This has been my carry for the past three weeks or so. Been loving it. And the CQC6, if you're not aware, it has a blade of, let's check, let's check this out. 3.3 inches, eight inches overall, just like the CQC7, of course, with a different style of handle. So very similar to the previous comparison, but you can see right here, right? The package of the CQC5 is definitely a smaller package for those that like something like that. Let me grab some smaller blades so that we can compare right here the mini cqc7 i think this is what three inches so same thing 2.75 inches and the beauty of the cqc5 is that thinness in that design of the handle okay compared to that cqc7 and i'm talking about this dimension of course i love the thickness in this dimension that we have in this package right here again just a beauty. I have some other way smaller releases that you know they did recently. This is the little auto bull shark and definitely a smaller blade overall in this auto from Air Emerson Knives. And of course the Jumbuck is another little blade right here that we have now available. And this guy, I do not have a clip because usually I just drop this in my pocket but if you're looking for something a little bit bigger than the Jumbok, hey the cqc5 might be a perfect edc for you as well and guys other than that let me give you another run on this beauty okay the fully blacked out cqc5 hand checker handles 
Look at this freaking beauty. Beautiful swatch right there. Hopefully the camera can capture all those detail, details. And this in the other side. And it's just a freaking beauty. Guys, other than that, you know where to find me in Calo PR on Instagram. And of course, in caloblaze.com under the recommendation menu, I do have all the groups that were always hanging out. Emerson Echo Group, Emerson Operators, and the USN Forums. You guys have a great day out there. Bye.